Well, today, guys, we're going to be cutting some stuff. And I'm going to 3D print and design, or design and 3D print some scissors. Just to uh, see if I can and see if they work. See if I got it. Stay tuned. All right, so where to begin with scissors? I'm trying to make it as simple as possible to print them out on the resin printer because I feel like that's going to be the hardest one to so to have a cutting edge so I think what I'm gonna do is try to replicate this pair of scissors not to a T just enough to cut a piece of paper but let's see what we can do and go here on the top and I will make the bolt hole the center of the sketch top plane we will make the blade first so bolt hole let's see bolt hole Look at that. Now I should be able to get that to work. And I have washers I can pull on either side, so I might just stick with the M3 by 16. So there's the scissors. So I'm gonna get to printing this and bring you guys back. Well, actually I'm gonna show you guys the uh, slicing. Okay, so we got the slicing software open. I need to rotate this on z-axis 90 degrees 90 all right and then I need to flip it on the y-axis 180 180 there we go. that's just so that we can get a good print along this edge because we're gonna ha we're gonna have to sharpen it I guarantee we are so what I'll do here is just copy this, copy one time. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, oh okay. Reset. That's, that is not what I wanted. Copy one and move. There we go. So I need to move this this move this like this and it should do it so let's see how long this is going to take it shouldn't take very long it should take probably about 30 minutes but we will see i think we're going to spend more time yeah 38 minutes in order to do it you can see that right here see what kind of printer i have and Here's the waiting game. Bring you guys back when it uh, starts printing.
All right, so they're doing 3D printing. So if you look, it's actually got blue on the blade and purple on the handle. So let's put these together, which I'm already seeing that might have an issue with it bowing because it's so thin at this center or the tip. Sorry. Um, but let's get some hardware and put these together and see if they cut paper. Oh, yeah. We got some scissors. And we don't have the back of it, but to keep it from going too far. But there we go. And so to see if it cuts paper. And I do have a piece of paper here. Let's see. Okay. <laughs> uh, it's it's cutting. I do have two edges here. Uh, this is going to be the most cuttable edge. <laughs> I'm gonna write and draw something <laughs> on a piece of paper and I'm gonna cut it out but you guys ain't gonna see what I'm drawing love you guys let's do this okay let's see if it cuts out it's like kindergarten I'm really certain I just made some left-handed scissors. Now I'm right-handed. If there's such thing. Because everything is on the opposite side. I knew this was gonna happen. Resin scissors. I have to say, uh, they work, but don't expect to be cutting out anything faster than a regular pair of scissors. Because the problem being, they got so much flex in them. Which, I mean, I guess I could make them thicker. But, uh, you got too much flex. So if you look at the gap in between the two, they want to bow out. And this is supposed to be like the ABS resin here, which... It's hard if you have thick pieces, kind of like this. All right, so I kind of put an edge on it. I got this little bit left on this heart. But if you can see, <laughs> uh, got a little bit of an edge on it. Oh, that's actually working really well now. See if I can finish it off. Then. Wow, I must have spoke too soon. And so I made some modifications, so to speak, and I think I got it figured out.
It does not like already pre-bent paper though. It does not. And you ain't cutting two slices at the same time, or two pieces at the same time. But you can successfully cut better now. And I'll show you the first piece. And y'all make the determination whether or not they're working. Like I said, does not like. You gotta get a nail it just to get it to cut that. You got to, like I said, does not, it doesn't like, like lonely pieces of paper. Got that. Because all it does is bend it over. Let me try to cut it from this way. Well, there we go. Figured I'd show you guys, do a comparison. I think uh, this is the one I just cut out. A lot straighter than that. But uh, like and subscribe till the next one. And yeah, I know I keep looking at the screen and not the camera. I know somebody's going to say something. What are you doing, man? You're such a brat. This chair is not big enough for both of us. Let's go. Let's go. Come on. Let's. No, not that way. All right, go. Oh.